Hey guys, this is a video on how to apply custom ringtones for an LG Triton with Altel service. Two things you're going to need before we get started is a micro SD and a micro USB data cable. Now what you're going to need to do is click the first link in the description. It should download the LG 7000 driver. And you're going to run the setup file. Click yes. And OK. Run. The security thing might come up. Click OK. There, your drivers are installed. And you can move on to step two. Now you're going to click the second link in the description and that's for the program to interact with your phone. Click on save and then wait for that to download. Once that's downloaded you're gonna open it click on run click next click the accept the terms next, next Install. Then it's going to start up for you. After you plug it in, the screen's going to come up that says um, what connection type. If you haven't uh, done this yet before, you're going to have to click on USB Mass Storage, and then that'll set up your directory. After you've done that, you can disconnect, and then reconnect it. And this time, you're going to click on USB Modem. It'll be the top one. After you've plugged in your phone and clicked USB modem, you're going to have to open that program that you downloaded called BitPim. <coughs> open that up and it will be de detecting your phone. You're going to have to remember what COM number it's on. Click OK. Come up to the top under edit and click on settings click on phone wizard over on the right side go down till you find the LG VX um, 9700 and it has dare in parentheses click on that and then over here in the left you're going to click on the com that it um, said it was found on you first opened it, and then click next. Click def detect phone, and it'll probably fail, but that's all right. Click finish, and then OK. Now you're gonna come in here under file system, and click on this plus sign for the directory. And it will take a minute to find it, so you're just gonna have to hang on. Once it finally loads, you're going to click on D, on the deload folder. You're going to locate mysound.dat. You're going to save that to your desktop. And then you're going to delete it. Now once you've deleted that, you're going to come into brew. You're going to expand that folder. Expand media. Expand LK and then click on MS. It's important that you click on the MS folder located under LK. And once you've done that, you're going to see all your standard ringtones. I've already got some on there, so you can see the top couple that I put on there. And then you're just going to drag any MP3 over there. 
or any ringtone that you want. Once you've done that, you're going to click send to phone or send phone data. Click on ringtone or check the box ringtone and click OK. Once you've done that, your phone should shut off and restart itself. And once it comes on, you should have cu your custom ringtone or whatever MP3 that you dragged over. And you'll be able to apply it just like you bought it from Altel.